In this video, I'm going to show you how you can run EMC Grab on an ESXi host. EMC Grab is a log collection utility that runs locally on an ESXi host and gathers storage specific information such as HPA driver version, uh, LUN details and etc. It can be used for planning upgrades and troubleshooting issues. In the past, we used to just run the vm-support command to collect the support logs and turn those over to the storage team. But they are no longer happy with those since EMC now has a grab that supports vSphere hosts. Uh, so first thing, you'll need to download the proper EMC grab version to support your hosts. So if you go to ftp.emc.com pub emc grab, ESXi, you can see the latest and the greatest version of the Grab tool which is 1.3.2. So after you download the zip file, you'll unzip the file and the tool is is an .exe file that will create the log zip file which you can upload to EMC or provide it to your storage team. So it is recommended that you run this tool in non-business hours as it may cause some performance degradation. So EMC Grab is a command line tool that you can run with different switches. So here is the screenshot that will show all the supported switches for EMC Grab.exe. Okay, so let me show you how this is done. So I've already downloaded the EMC Grab tool which is a zip file which is sitting on my desktop of my vCenter server. So I'm going to unzip this file. So inside this folder you can see there's an .exe file called EMC Grab.exe. So this is the file that is used to collect the logs. So I need to open this file in a command prompt window to collect the logs. So let me close out of this and open command prompt. I'm going to go into that folder, cd desktop, cd esxi, grab, cd emc, alright I'm in the directory so I'll type the below command which is emc grab.exe minus host. So the host should be IPv4 address and you cannot type the host name or IPv6 address. So let me type the IPv4 address of my host which is 192.168.10.4 and then I'm going to specify the user which is root and then I'm going to specify the password which is and then I'm going to include VM support which includes vSphere log bundle in the grab output and then I'm going to specify the output directory so that that will be my desktop C drive users administrator dot contoso slash desktop slash emc grab output and then I'm going to I'm going to specify quiet switch which will suppress all feedback so before I run this command I need to make sure that I've created a folder called EMC grab output. So let me create that. Alright, so we are good to go. Let me press enter on the command. Alright, so I'm going to agree to the license terms by typing the letter Y. So if you are submitting this log to the EMC then you may need to specify the customer party number or the site ID which I don't have so I'm going to press enter and you'll specify your company name 
which I don't have again and the contact name I'm gonna skip it I'm gonna skip my phone number my email address and the SR number so you can see it is saying ESX server is generating log bundle please wait alright so it is done and it is saying thank you for using EMC grab so if I minimize this I should be seeing the output so here we go so this is the EMC grab log file which is already zipped so this is the grab file that you can use it to upload it to EMC or you can provide this to your storage team thanks for watching this video for more videos please subscribe to my channel.